chubacabra has been attributed to the possibility that there are thylacine in North America. And what? here's what supports that. There is documented proof that there were two breeding pair of thylacine bound for the Bronx Zoo. And the boat crashed into the shore and most of the animals escaped, including the two breeding pair of thylacine. Fast forward 10, 15 years, you start having these chubacabra sightings pop up in the Northeast. And these animals were adapted to living in Tasmania, which is a pretty similar climate to the North American Northeast. And so uh, there's people that have kind of drawn these parallels and said, oh, the chubacabra that we've reported running around you know, the United States is actually a tiny remnant population of these thylacine that were brought here for the Bronx Zoo that escaped. What? You buy into this? No.